This is all presented by our friends over at Stone Academy. We're just talking about today is a big day. It's Galentine's Day, which I didn't know, but I'm happy to celebrate. You celebrate with the gals in your life, That's right? That's right. Before it gets all mushy and lovey dovey tomorrow, this is the holiday to uh, focus in on your female friendships. Uh -huh. and, and how did this start? It was like eight years ago, right? Yeah, it, it's actually from an episode of Parks and Recreation, but it's gaining a lot of attention this year uh -huh. as females are strong, they're joining forces. Independent. So there you go, celebrate. And look at these gals. We did. Huh? There's my gal pal. Oh, Megan Yost. How are you guys celebrating today? Um, well, we were not. We were thinking about having cocktails, and then mm -hmm. that oh, backfired. Well, you're right. The whole pregnant <laughs> aspect of it. According to the National Retail Federation, fewer people are celebrating Valentine's That's Day this sad. year. That's kind of Only 51 percent. The cards must be too expensive. Ah, those those 4.99 <laughs> cards. Too much, I guess. 4.99 is actually a bargain. You must not have purchased a card yet. N uh, no, of course I did. Yes, <laughs> I, I've, I've got mine. I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Right. Okay. Moving on now to our four-legged friends. A new king has been given a crown. Yes. This wire. Fox Terrier named King was chosen as best in show at the Westminster Dog Show. I'm sure you're all tuned in for that. Uh, but that's one of the big ones. Here's a fun fact: the Wire Fox Terriers have won 15 times. Oh wow! At these at, at this prestigious show, who would have thunk? I, I, I guess if you're into the bloodline, apparently, huh? I and dogs. Now, now you know. I think you should submit Sid, your dog, into that My show. Into I don't think she'd future. be in the running. Oh, all, right. <laughs> all right. So, does your toddler sound like he or she just popped in from downtown Abbey? Uh, or maybe they're having a spot of tea. Literally, and that's because some parents here are saying that there's a growing number of kiddos <laughs> that are walking around with British accents. Maybe even your kids there, Teresa. Well, or I have you. to say, we're big Peppa Pig f uh, family. Fans. We're fans here. That was our Halloween costume. And Dante says he's for swimming lessons. He needs his swimming costume. Okay. And wonders when we're going on holiday again. On holiday. So Peppa is rubbing off. Okay. But there are a lot of nice lessons with Peppa Pig, so I'm okay with it. All right. Well, it's better than your kids watching reruns of the Wahlburgers. They'd be running around saying, hey, Ma, can you get me a burger? Park the car. Go get me some fruit roll-ups. You know, like a Boston accent. It's better it. than I that, get it. maybe. Yeah. I you're get, right. right. I guess, or a New York <laughs> accent. Why don't you give us your British accent? I don't have one. We just learned that there's not just one British accent. There's hundreds of British accents from some friends from Scotland that are that are on with the I'd like them to gonna... judge your British your uh, accent. How's this? Well. Ready? S scale of one to ten. Literally, I'm literally British. <laughs> <laughs> no, they, they don't even uh, know what to say. All They're right. just laughing. Oh. <laughs> I'm just gonna sit here. A five. A five. five. A five That's out of average. ten. There That's we go. Average. Okay. We'll we'll keep working on it. I wow. guess. Let's move on to we should. an exciting new trailer that just dropped. Frozen. I'm sure you're tired of the song. I'm not. Let, let it go. go. I'm so excited for this. There is a sequel. Today, Disney dropped a new trailer for Frozen 2. It features Elsa the Ice Princess leaping across the ocean in an action scene, leaving us wanting more, Ooh, right? The film is going to hit theaters in November, which means another song. There was Let It Go. So what's the next song going to be? Because I think you're going to be singing it nonstop in your living room. I'm not sure. We'll have to wait for the movie to come out. Tune in. November. So it's Elsa and, and then... Anna, her sister. Anna. Okay. All right. Yes. We'll and Sved. And Sved? Sved? Sved, I think, is the reindeer. It, it depends on how many and drinks Olaf, you have. And then, <laughs> oh, right. Olaf, that's true. That is true. All right. Hey, guys, we have this really cool video. Check out the moves of this six year old young man. He's a wrestler. Now, consider Ooh. Nick Trotter. He's been born with no feet and without a left hand, but his parents say that his disability has never stopped him from doing things that he loves, including multiple sports. This kid is a standout Look right here. Oh, this is an inspiration. How neat is Fantastic. that? Fantastic. His parents say his determination and positivity really motivate everyone. How sweet is that? Good for him. Mm -hmm.